In 2015, four elite poker pros defeated the most developed poker artificial intelligence in the world, and now the computer is back for a rematch. Starting next week, poker pros Jason Less, Dong Kim, Daniel McCauley, and Jimmy Chow will battle the bot, nicknamed Labratus, over 20 consecutive days with $200,000 up for grabs. Libratus was developed by a team of computer scientists at Carnegie Mellon University, the same team that created Claudico, the AI that competed in the first match in 2015. The humans came out on top the first time, but won by a margin of less than one half of 1% of the total amount bet. Tuoma Sandholm, the computer science professor at CMU in charge of the project, called it a quote, statistical tie, but considered it a significant accomplishment for his AI. This time the match will consist of 120,000 hands of Heads Up No Limit Hold'em, 50% more hands than in 2015. With a bigger sample size, researchers hope to get a clearer picture of who has the upper hand. Californian poker pro Jason Less played in the first match, and he said he's excited to see how the AI has developed. Quote, I thought Claudico was tough to play knowing the resources and the ideas that Dr. Sandholm and his team have had available in the 20 months since the first contest, I assume this AI will be even more challenging." End quote. The development of an AI as sophisticated as Libratus has serious implications. Computers have dominated humans in other games, including chess and even Jeopardy, but poker has always posed a big challenge. And compared to other fixed limit forms of poker, No Limit Hold'em, even Heads Up, is generally thought to be too complicated to be beaten by a bot. With concerns on the rise about artificial intelligence software being used in real money online poker games, the development of a bot that can successfully beat humans in No Limit Hold'em has many in the poker world worried. For more poker news updates, head to pokerlistings.com.